Hello and welcome to Faith and Fun, Wheat Hill Benefices afternoon service for all ages held once a month on the fourth Sunday of the month. My name is Jane Durham and I'm the incumbent. We usually meet in Kenton Church, but unfortunately at the moment that isn't possible. So here we are meeting online. I'm going to be looking today at the journey that Jesus took with two of his followers on Easter Day on the road to Emmaus. And so we begin with the earth, with the church's traditional Easter greeting. Hallelujah, Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Alleluia. Let us pray. God, we gather as your people. We come to walk a journey together, to talk and to share along the way, to meet and to know Jesus. Help us to marvel at all that Jesus has done for us. Amen. Easter is a time of year that we often associate with chocolate. I don't know about you, but I've eaten all my Easter eggs. But it's not just about chocolate. It is, of course, about far more than that, nice though chocolate may be. And it's the time when we remember primarily and above all what Jesus did on the cross and that he rose again from the dead three days later. On the Friday, he died and on the Sunday, he rose. And so we're going to come to our confession. There's a cross on the screen. And what I would like you to do is to say sorry to God because it's what we did and what we do and what people have done down through the years from the beginning of time that means we need to say sorry. And so we're going to say sorry to God by whispering into our hands. And then we're going to bring that and put it at the foot of the cross, leaving it there with Jesus. You may need to get up from where you are to do that. You may be able just to move forward as I can. But that's how we're going to say sorry. We whisper and then we bring it to the foot of the cross. So let's say sorry. And now for the good news. In Jesus, we are forgiven so we can raise our hands and we can say, thank you, God, for all that you have done for us and all that you have given to us. And especially for your gift of life and of forgiveness. Amen. And we're going to have a song now. Alleluia. Alleluia. Give thanks to the risen Lord. 